What's up you guys, y'all know who it is, it's your boy Mike Ish B. Today, we're gonna be talking about transitions, how to get them, how I use my transitions, and really just how to make your videos, again, better. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. Here at this channel, man, we talk everything about Luma Fusion, Final Cut Pro, Logic Pro, even some Garage Band, but mostly Luma Fusion to get your videos the best quality that they could possibly be. So, I'm gonna go find some place to shoot. I gotta hurry up because the sun really finna come out, and I wanna make sure I get that nice cinematic look with my phone. Today, we're talking about transitions. Let's go. Whoa. Okay, you guys, so I came out here to my local park, man, um, because they have waterfalls and they have a lot of trees and just a lot of stuff out here, man. They have trees and they have a playground sitting back that way. But um, I just give me a lot more to shoot B-roll in and teach you guys how to do these transitions. Now, the way I do my transitions, I'm going to put a B-roll shot in right now, is like this. I just pretty much find the focus point and find my lighting point before I even start um, recording. Once I started recording, I just kind of do like this little circle motion, um, get the little five or six, ten seconds of footage that I want to get, and then I do the opposite circle motion up out of the frame. Okay, you guys, if you like this video, give a thumbs up. If you didn't like this video, give a thumbs down. If you're not yet subscribed, please consider subscribing. Here, man, we talk everything about Luma Fusion, Final Cut Pro, and even a little bit of Garage Band, but mostly Luma Fusion to get your videos the best quality they could be. All right, you guys, I'm out, man. Get back to the house to edit this video, man. People looking at me crazy and like, what is he doing? I'm recording video for YouTube. Duh.